I've got my fabric laid out, and then I'm gonna take my pumpkin. And this is just an old pumpkin that I bought from um, Away and Pay. I paid 79 cents a pound, Mom. and it didn't weigh anything. Yeah, you just pull that out. Um, and I took off the top. So did I. Yep, so she's doing one too. Yeah, I picked the boo fabric. This is all um, just that uh, styrofoam. So I'm just gonna push some of the styrofoam yeah. down in the hole. Mm -hmm. I might need to dig some of it out too. <laughs> okay, so I got my fabric. She got a fat quarter, and the fat quarters are 18 by 21. Okay, so I'm going to fab some of my. Me too. Okay, it'll fit perfect for me. Sorry, Me too, after she's. So hollow it out a little bit. Did you not see me just twist around to the to this side? Come on, a Dollar Tree bag. <laughs> dollar Tree. Come on. Oh, perfect. Dollar Tree, thank you. Hi! Okay, styrofoam goes everywhere, kids. Okay, now I've loosened it up. So now that I've loosened it up some, I can stick my finger down there and dig some of it out. This is for you. Now you need a lot of holes. This is hollow inside. Mama, show what you were doing with your finger. I'm just digging some of that out. Yeah, also see how much she's done. You need somewhere for the fabric to go. Yeah. Okay, so now you've got your hole in your pumpkin. So you're going to stick. Approximately this size. Like. <clears throat> eighth. Okay, so Me? look, you, I took the pumpkin, put it in the middle of the fabric, and then I put um, one corner in the pumpkin. Yeah, that's weird. And then I'm going to just gather the fabric up to the next corner and, then you and push down on the pumpkin and then you do the, the sides up, and then the pumpkin gather the fabric up put it in the pumpkin just keep doing that all the way around until it's done like she's yeah. done it really fast and i'm still I'm not done because you got to straighten it up and once you get it all wrapped ow ow you gotta straighten it up and see i don't like this piece right here so let me undo that a little bit I thought I was doing it perfect. It was perfect until I had to undo it. Okay, so one corner. Wait, first let me gather it up. And put you down. So we gather you up. And put you down. This way she fits. Do each corner, honey, and then tuck the center how you want it. Like once you get the corners done. Then you can... So, mine fits, because I just tested it out. Yeah, then you can start tucking the raw edges of it. Yeah, my mom's an expert at this, so, like, if this is hard for you, uh, I'm, I gotcha, I gotcha. You're just like me. I don't know how to you do this. Okay. This is horrible. Watch. Horrible this. You got it in the middle, right? Mm -hmm. So, you're gonna tuck. I've been doing that. Tuck. Tuck. You're good. You're good. Okay. okay. Tuck. That's all you do is you tuck. Tuck. Yep. And if you don't like how something looks, you can just straighten it up after, or you can just start all over again. But what if it doesn't fit? It will fit. Let me see. But this okay, see, so I've got some of those pieces that won't fit. So what we're going to do is we're just going to untuck the last corner, fold it under. Oh. <laughs> and then, you know, you see what I'm saying? Yeah. So that'll straighten it out. So this ain't the prettiest of pumpkin. Well, you're not done. You just gotta, yeah. you just gotta keep tucking, baby. I'm done, mom. I know, but you gotta tuck it tight. So you gotta keep straight, keep pulling them up. It won't go. <laughs> and that's how you, that's pumpkin toss right there. That's a different game. Yeah. That's a game, not a craft. <laughs> yeah. That's off this side. I think I You can actually paint the stems if you want to, but I kind of like them green. This is how Mom is doing. Mom, you look like you're molding. You look like you're trying. You're, you look like you're trying to do pottery. Mm. You're perfect at this. You're precious. And you're perfect. Oh, right, yeah. Mama, we have to hot
Please don't poke it through anymore. Mama, stop, 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 it needs fixed. Well, fix it. It's got hot glue in there, so hurry up and fix it. I'm so scared about it. Spooky, scary skeleton. Who loves spooky, scary skeletons? I think that's good, Mom. Mm -hmm. Three pack for a dollar, and then this one, that one, and that one's kind of pretty without anything on it. But we're gonna cover them all. I don't like the color of this one, so I'm kind of excited to cover that one. And that one's kind of pretty without anything, but we're gonna cover it. And then I found this one. I'm not gonna cover this one. I'm just going to include this one in with my pumpkins because that one's just really pretty, and this one's glass. Those. And then I have some scrap fabric 
just in solid purple. And this is kind of a sparkly, shimmery purple and black. And then I bought this today at Walmart. It's the Waverly. I think I paid about $6 for this. And this is just those, what are they called? Fat squares? Fat quarters. We've got that pattern. Oh, I like this one. This one's kind of Halloween-y to me. It reminds me of a crow. Just some kind of bubbly polka dots. Oh, I like that one, too. It's got a gray. I don't know how good my camera is, but there's a gray stripe and then some black stripes. And that one kind of reminds me of a witch. So, we're going to take our pumpkin. Pull the tag off. You kind of injure it a little bit when you pull the tag off, but that's okay because we're going to cover that up. And we're going to just pop off this top. So it's just a top just like that. And these right here are hollow. So you should be able to push down this hole a little bit more. See there's a hole in it. These aren't as hollow as the other ones. This kind of got some styrofoam in there. So I'm just going to push some of that down. Just enough where I can tuck some of the fabric down in that hole. I think I'll dig a little bit of that out. make a mess. Okay, I just dug enough of it out where I could stick it all the way to my big knuckle. That should be enough. And I don't know, my fabric's probably, what, about 10 inches square? Not even perfectly square. The fabric does not have to be perfect because you're going to tuck your raw edges in anyway. So once I get enough of the pumpkin out of the middle, the styrofoam, I'm just going to go around and tuck in all of the corners. Just going around the pumpkin, tucking the corners in into the hole you made. You just want to get all that orange covered up. Let you see no more of it. You want it pretty tight. Okay. See? And now I'm just going to take my topper and just stick it back in the hole. And there we go. And the topper stays in because that fabric's pretty tight, but you could take, see I can get it back out, but you could take a dab of hot glue and just stick it down in there. And there's my recreated pumpkin. Paid a dollar for the pumpkin, and then I just used a scrap piece of purple fabric we had laying around that we got at a um, thrift store. It was just a bulk purchase. Um, so, how pretty is that? A lot prettier than the normal Dollar Tree pumpkins. I'm gonna pull off the top. Just it should pull straight up. You don't have to wiggle it a little bit. Set it aside. And I'm going to poke a hole right in the top. Pull it out. Pull that chunk out right there. I'm gonna move this fabric so I don't get the styrofoam on it because these are made of styrofoam. Grab me some scissors, and I'm just going to dig some of that star phone out.
You don't want to go all the way to the bottom because you don't want to poke a hole in the bottom, but you do want quite a bit of that styrofoam out. <laughs> I'm just making a mess. It's going everywhere. You can stick your finger in there and kind of dig around too. Because you need somewhere for that fabric to go. that's about to your knuckle. Okay, once you get all the fabric wrapped on there pretty tight, you're going to take the topper. You can stick a little hot glue on there if you like, and you're just going to stick it on top. I'm going to take my pumpkin, I'm going to take the tag off, I'm going to pull the top off. Going to make my hole. I'll move that out of the way so I don't get stuck on all over it. Peel that off. Pull it out. I'm going to do this one over a trash bag because I've made a mess the last couple of ones so I'm done. And I'm going to dig a lot of this styrofoam out. Take my pumpkin, put it in the middle of a fat quarter, and just start tucking it in. See, I'm just going to tuck, 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 just pull and tuck. For some reason, the oblong one is harder to do. I don't know. I can't find exactly how I'm liking it here. It's like I'm leaving too much fabric out.
Okay. You can kind of see the orange through it, but that's okay. It's still super easy, pretty cute. And then I'm going to take the topper. You can put a little hot glue on it and stick it down in there. How cute are these turning out, guys? I'm going to take my solid purple this time. Pour up the top. That one's sticky. The rest haven't been sticky. I'm going to dig out some of the star foam again. square, lay the pumpkin in the center, and start tucking away. Okay. Once I get it all wrapped, I'm going to take my topper, stick it in there. It would be pretty if I spray painted these black or something, make them stick out more. I can put a dab of hot glue on it to keep it in place. And I have me a purple pumpkin. I'm going to try a small one. I've never done a small one, so I'm not sure if this is going to turn out. These have clips. So I'm just going to pull that right off the clip because I don't need that clip. So I'm going to pull the top off. The top came off when I did that, but that's okay. I'm just going to go ahead and pull that off. I'm going to do this a little more gen gentle because I don't want to go too deep on it. So I'm going to cut some of that stuff from out. This probably looks least like a 
pumpkin from the rest that I've done. This one's got a little, the pointed thing stuck out. Maybe I should have broken that off. Let's see if I put the stem back on if it'll look like a pumpkin. Yeah, I guess it kind of looks like a pumpkin. I just can't get the fabric in very well. I might go back and redo that one. But that's all the ones I've got for now. I'm addicted to this craft, so I can promise you this is not going to be all the ones that I do. If you like this, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and make sure and leave me a comment below. Thank you for watching. Bye.